Oh my god! I can't tell, but it's just rip and drag. Oh, we didn't make it in time. Had to stay in some crappy little motel last night for a couple hours. But, uh, we're going to get back on the road. We're about two hours away from Greg's. We're going to get back on the road, get to Greg's, and go fishing. Made it to the spot where we're going to be pulling the kayaks out. So this is, this is where we're going to be finishing the float. We, uh, we got a shuttle. We have my man Greg right here. We're gonna, so we're going to go to it, man. Where are we right now? We are in Clearwater, Minnesota. And the Mississippi River is right over there and it's very high, but it looks very good. So we're going to be just targeting current breaks and there should be a ton of wood in the water that we can throw to, big top waters and uh, it should be awesome, dude. Sweet. Yeah. Cool. And we're taking the shuttle. Yep, Clearwater uh, Outfitting, CW Outfitting out of Clearwater, Minnesota. Yeah, it's awesome. uh, they're setting us up. Simon, the man, the man, and um, cool. I'm so excited. I keep I'm, 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 I'm stoked. Myself. Been on a smaller kick lately. Great catches some giant smallmouth up here, so this, this, this is gonna be awesome. But we gotta finish getting loaded up, and I'll see you guys on the water. Current's moving pretty good. Uh, we're, we're looking for little current breaks. That's where the where the fish should be should be sitting. I'm still waiting on Greg to get ready. He has like 300 pounds of equipment that he's got to get all rigged up and ready because he's crazy. But now he goes, uh, he's got all his cameras and stuff, so it's taking a while. He's got the trolling motor. So once he's out here, he's going to be running circles around us. But uh, yeah, I'm going to just fish around here a little bit and wait for him to get ready and see if I can find some fish. It's going to be tough to fish without a trolling motor like he's got. I mean, this current is kicking. I, wasn't, I was not expecting this. Oh, I, I got one. That feels big, too. Oh, it's a nice one. Is my camera on? Is it is. Wow. First, that's like first cast. This thing is strong. This current makes this kind of sketchy. Right where you said it would be, too, right in that current break. I don't have my hog trough. Oh, that's a nice fish. It's a nice fish. Come on. She don't want, want to quit. She does not want to quit. That's, 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 a, that's a three pounder, three and a half pounder at least. Three, three and a half. I cannot get her to quit. Come on. Trying to football grab her. Got her. That was a nice smallie. Man, right where you said she'd be. Fight that current because you don't, I don't even know where that goes. I don't know if that's where we're supposed to go. Paddle. Oh, that was nuts. This current is kicking. Pretty much one or two casts, I can't remember. And I already got that freaking little pig right there. But I'd say that's, that's about a three pounder. It's about a three pounder. Was not expecting the current to be pushing that hard. And this guy just freaking slammed it. And uh, right where, right in a current break, right where Greg said they'd be, right where I knew they'd be. Big as that first one, but she's a fighter. Oh, she's not bad. Oh, pike. It's a pike. And 
much he choked it. And, oh man, slimy little guy. So, not what we want, but uh, yeah, still kind of fun, I guess. Now, if I could catch like a 30 plus inch pike, that'd be kind of cool. But uh, yeah, see you, dude. There she is. What oh, I have? This is gonna be a pike. Oh, Smolly. Man, that guy smashed it. Absolutely wrecked it. Not a bad one. Not a bad one. Ooh! Come on, Mama. Tell you what, I didn't think it was that big at first. She kept getting bigger. Oh yeah, put my head mounts on. Oh, choked it. She really wanted it. Chill out. That's a good fish. We're gonna wreck it. Okay, so I'm gonna do a little midday update. I have two so far, um, both fish are over 17 inches, right around probably about three pounds. Um, caught a little pike, had some other pike munching. Greg's got one, I'm not sure how big it is, and Faith doesn't have any yet, but that's okay, she's a trooper. She's not used to fishing rivers, and this current is really, really kicking out here. But it's a beautiful freaking day, so she's enjoying herself. Yeah, the bite's kind of tough. They're definitely just chilling in the eddies. They're hiding behind logs, any kind of rock piles that are, you know, any points that are out and there's creating an eddy behind it. They're just hanging out right in the eddy, waiting the ambush. And uh, yeah, the bite, like I said, the bite's been a little tough. Um, I'm definitely a little jealous of Greg because he's got his little trolling motor and he's zipping, zipping around and having no problem getting in the position. I'm having a little bit of problem doing that with just a paddle because of how strong the current really is. But uh. Yeah, I mean, it's like 80 degrees. It's beautiful. I was worried about it being cold. Minnesota's awesome. But uh, yeah, let's get some more fish. Oh yeah, I don't even know if I got that jump on. <clears throat> hooked up with, hooked up with another decent one. These things are feisty. The other one was definitely a fish too because oh god they, you don't think they're that big and then you realize like they're all they're about three pounds it's a good fish this one's jump it's the first one that's actually jumped like this come on dude it's probably the smallest one and it's still come on oh my gosh soak me a bunch of times huh Okay. Ugh. Got it. Okay, okay. Why do you guys gotta eat them so deep? Make it hard for me. Still not a bad fish. That's definitely the smallest one so far. See ya. No! Camera wasn't rolling. Oh my gosh. I just had a huge one. I was reeling it in. A giant freaking came right by the kayak. Probably a five, at least a five pounder. Oh my god. Oh, that sucks. Wish the, I wish that would, the camera hit it, the thing hit it on the surface. And I wasn't rolling. Oh man. Oh, it's boiling. <laughs> Why couldn't I have been rolling to get that surface shot? This is a pretty big fish. This caused him some pretty big boils. Long. This might be the biggest one. I can't tell yet. Oh my god, it's so strong. I can't believe how many how big the bulls are that it's making. It's biting like it's a six pounder and it's not. Come on. Oh god. It's pretty big though. You're coming in. 
Oh my gosh, stop, stop. Oh, he's barely hooked. Stop. Okay, you're just yanking him in. He's not even anywhere as near as big as I thought he was. <laughs> just such a strong freaking fighter. He's been caught too. It's not even anywhere near as big as I thought it was. It's nice though, solid. Not a bad one. Floats almost over too, so that's a pretty good way to end it after missing so many of these guys. See you later, dude. I think that was the best fight of the day, and he wasn't even the biggest. Big old tail. It's a river fish. Unbelievable. Got hit right on the boat. But they're stacked right here. Oh, oh God. <laughs> no. They're so freaking strong. Oh, get in here. That one right there is pretty big. Man, he choked it. Actually, about the, it's about the same size, I guess. Man, they were just stacked through there. There were so many fish through there. Call you crazy, Joe. Well, we got everything loaded up. I wanted to shoot the outro at the ramp, but it was already dark and we were kind of blocking the ramp and had to get all our stuff loaded up and everything. But uh, wasn't a bad day. I caught like seven fish. I missed like freaking 20, so it was almost an amazing day, but still a good day. But we're gonna go get some food now. We're gonna be back at it again tomorrow. I'm gonna put a link in the description to Greg's channel so you can check him out. He has some awesome content he calls his show another fishing show so check it out give him a follow hit the subscribe button on his channel and like always make sure you subscribe to this channel and i will see you guys tomorrow